Senator Moss, Senator Newberger, Congressman Ullman, and uh, Senator Magnuson from Washington. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to express uh, a warm thanks from a uh, citizen from the other side of the country for your warm welcome today. I came here as a result of, uh, I will not say consistent prodding, but I will say that uh, on every occasion I've seen Senator Moss, uh, this matter has come up in one way or another. And uh, therefore, I felt it incumbent upon me in looking at the natural resources of the United States. I could not return to Washington safely without coming here to uh, some point. So we are here today, and we're here to take a look at what is a great national asset. I've been looking at great natural assets. Jackson Hole and our mountains, valleys, and all the rest. Well, this is a national asset. A good deal of effort, a good deal of money, a good deal of dedication has gone into building this facility. And I think you can only get an impression of the importance of this facility by coming down and looking at it and standing on it. Therefore, as a result of the considered judgment of your delegation and also of the Budget Bureau and the various areas of our executive, I want to announce that the best first step in reactivating this facility appears to be a multi-purpose use. It is therefore a pleasure to be able to tell you that both the Department of Defense and the Coast Guard will shortly initiate activities here. Early next year, <laughs> early next year, the Department of Defense will establish a weapons system acquisition management school here at Tongue Point. This school will be jointly staffed by our military department and provide training for senior civilian personnel and senior military officers for all the services and the Defense Department. And shortly after this training activity begins, the Coast Guard will establish a helicopter rescue base here. Both agencies will soon begin their planning in cooperation with the General Services Administration. And we will go ahead in attempting to see what other multi-purpose projects can be brought here so that this facility can be used and so that uh, this community can benefit. I'm glad I came here. I think it is a national asset, and I think that the wise use of it, I think, requires us uh, to consider very carefully what services of government can be lodged here, because we don't want all this great asset to merely go to waste. I'm glad to come back here.